Hello everybody and welcome back with some more ARK Survival Evolved. So today I have I have some intentions. I have some plots are afoot. Um, and that is I want to go and tame a couple of Dilophosaurs if I can. Because, well, uh, I've been looking at the kibble chain and basically a lot of the animals I want to tame... Their kibble is made out of dilophosaur eggs, so yeah, we're, we're going to need to get a whole bunch of dilo eggs, so I figure why not go hunt some down. Now, let, let me check my engrams real quick. I forget. Do I have the recipe for mortar and pestle? I do. I, I'm, I'm tempted to, well, you know what, for now, that was a fairly easy to tame. Let's just go and gather up a whole bunch of narco berries so we can keep them knocked out while we're taming them. I have enough meat, I, I just need something to keep them down, down and out while they get tamed. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just stuff a whole bunch of horrible looking little berries. Uh, seriously, I don't like eating food that is black in color. I, I've never really liked blackberries. Like, I, I would much prefer to have a raspberry, like the squid ink pasta. All those things are like kind of a, a dark black color. I, I just, it seems like something would be rotting or weird for it to turn black. So, yeah, I, 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 if I was in the wild, I definitely wouldn't like experiment with eating all these strange narco berries. I would write them off almost immediately. Uh, every other berry, except maybe actually yellow berries, because typically yellow berries are deadly poisonous <laughs> so um like there are very few yellow colored berries that um if you're stranded out in the wilderness would be safe to eat so and actually the red ones as well uh unless you're unless you're 100 percent certain that such and such a berry is okay to eat uh i i, I wouldn't sample them even in the wild, like, there, there's a plant that looks identical to a blackberry, but it will kill you if you eat it. So, <laughs> I mean, why, why risk it, you know? Anyway, let, let's see. How many, how many of those narco bears? 13. We could probably use a little more. Now, be on the lookout for Dilophosaurus. I, I definitely want... I want several of them, actually. So, we, we need to keep a lookout for them. And, you know, one male and a couple of females, uh, same as the, do the dodos, so, uh, because I have, a, I have a plan, once we hit, what level are we? We're probably, okay, level 10. In five more levels, we can learn one of our first saddle recipes, and that saddle is the Pachycephalosaurus saddle. Uh, it turns out they're actually pretty decent for taming stuff. Um, because they knock things out with their, their mighty, um, headbutt move. So, yeah, I want to, I want to tame a whole bunch of those. Well, not a whole bunch, probably like enough to start breeding them up and get, get one that's like a super Pachycephalosaurus. And I think that's going to be our main mount for the mid game is because uh, they're apparently, uh, fairly good at carrying, well, not carrying stuff, but, um, at movement, they have fairly high damage. They can take like some attacks as well so huh what, what do we have down there i wish i had a scope but i haven't quite done that yet okay that looks like triceratops it does look like there is dilophosaurus yeah that looks like a dilo keep, keep a lookout though another one behind us we want to be aware that there could be some other gnarly things here. So I'm thinking I'm just going to run up and smack him with a club. I got fairly high melee damage now. So interesting. Is he dead or stuck? Unconscious. I'm thinking there's a scorpion in the area. Well, let's take advantage of this. I mean, free meat is free meat. Um... We gotta watch out for scorpions, though. They are very dangerous. Uh, we have some stem berries. Oh, no. What did it? What did it? Okay. Back up a little bit. Oh. Meganura. I didn't know they could poison us. Okay, any more? No. 
Yeah, that's I, I did a little bit of reading. Uh, and Meganura, when you kill an animal, they're scavengers. So that's if you need to get a whole bunch of Meganura in one spot, that's how you do it. Let's get some Kaiden. Kaiden's good um, when, when you want to build like Kaiden armor. I'm not sure if we're going to go that route. Uh, the Kaiden armor has some drawbacks, but... I mean, it's actually, it's decent in some cases, but the main thing is it has no real, oh. I, I want to make sure, because this, this river can be a little bit dangerous. Yeah, you see all the dilos down there? Are they helping each other out? Hmm, I, I don't, that's a whole pack, isn't it? Oh, nope, oh, this one, this one will do. Come on, you, get knocked, get knocked out. <laughs> Oh, see, he's running away. I'm, I'm out of here. <laughs> Can't risk it. There, there are, like, way too many dialos there. Yeah, it's a little difficult to tame until you have, um... Come back here. Get down. <laughs> good, good, good. We, we got her knocked out. Um, here, have some meat. Have some narco berries. And we'll remote use that. Now, I still have the, the combat music, so I think she's mate boosted and her her mate's around, so. Okay, I don't. He ran over there somewhere, so. Um, let's just keep an eye out. Yeah, yeah, he ran off. I think, I think we'll, oh, no, he's coming back. Okay. Okay, you jerk. Come on. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. There we go. <laughs> Good, we'll tame two at once. Uh-oh. Oh no. Run, run, run. It looks like I attracted some friends. Ah, stupid spear. Come on. Come on. Come on. Nope. Not good. <laughs> Phew. Oh, what got me? Oi. Okay, let's respawn at our bed. Darn it. Um. Come on, open. Where's the door? Here's the door. So here's the advantage of having a bed. Basically, we're going to respawn here, and I know that they're just down this way. So I can hopefully run back and get my things. Um, it'd be nice to tame those Dilophosaurus, but yeah, we're starting to get, you kind of need to like find them in groups of one or two. We just kind of got overwhelmed at that point. So, let's run up there, and if any are still around, because the other thing is, I think that most dinosaurs are cannibals, if they're meat eaters, so if you knock one out, um, more will run up and try to eat the corpse. So, <laughs> something to keep in mind, you know, if you're making some nice fresh meat, awesome. We got our stuff back. Oh, and we, we tamed one. Um, no, no, accept, whatever. Okay, accept. Wild female unconscious. Okay, you. You're being a nuisance. Come on, my dinosaur friends. <laughs> Do something about this jerk. Okay, I'll let the other one attack him. Okay, E. Just take all. Um, okay, resume. <laughs> oh, this is, this is going well, isn't it? E. No! Stop it! Jerk! <laughs> oh. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Um, she'll probably have some goodies on her. Yeah, let's, let's take all from the inventory. And why waste good meat? <laughs> Jeez. Are you still taming? Awesome. Okay. Good, good, good. Um, where? Narco Bear is here. Have, have like two of them. Your torpor's awfully low. Well, we got one taming. Is this one dead? Ah, I hate that. I, I wish that... Mm. It would not ask you to name it immediately. 
Oh, well, let's see. Um, he's a male. Ah, whatever. I'll cancel. You can just be a... Unconscious. Okay. Um, uh, here, have some meats. And we need, we need those. Give us those... Give, give us that stuff. <laughs> You've tamed... Okay. Again with the... Okay. So I tamed two of them. <laughs> wow. That that one let's let's get out of here <laughs> before more of those little jerks show up. Come on guys. So I got let's see. I'm I'm gonna have to name both of these. I think I got a male and a female even, so that's nice. I, I definitely wanna tame a few more females. Oh why why okay. Okay, okay, so cool. Let, let's take them back to the home base. Can you repair the spear? I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll go back home for a second and get situated. I, I think um, I think we need to like honestly kind of repair some things and all that jazz. So, but we got two. That's a start. I, I want to tame like three or four even, like one male and three females should be good. And Ideally, like, I'd honestly let them follow me around, but I get kind of nervous about that since the, the office stores are kind of delicate creatures. They they tend to get, like, killed by things fairly easily. So, can I, st I still can't... Why can't I make the spear? I, I really, like... They need to do something where it, like, shows you what you need wood. Okay. When you, you click. And it's such a basic thing like I mean I could program that almost immediately and uh oh well <laughs> I, d I know it, I know how easy it is to program an alert message like that in unity I don't I have never tried to do anything in um quake full well the quake engine so I don't know maybe it's a little bit more difficult in the quake engine but it's it's awfully easy to have like a little alert pop up telling you what you still need to, to build something. So I don't know why they haven't done that. It, it seems like I always wonder this with developers actually, because sometimes they get like, it just, you'll wonder about it. Like, why is it that they didn't just set it up this way? But I don't know. I, I, I've never done like professional work. So for me, maybe I don't have deadlines to worry about. Maybe it just it's something that occurs in playtesting that you don't see when you're doing the straight programming side of things. I, I'm not sure. Anyway, so we got... Yeah, I'd like to get a whole bunch of dog office orders because we need their eggs. I, I'd also like to um, name these guys because, honestly, the names are not good. <laughs> um, wait, are you the male or the female? I don't remember. Um, was that an egg? Was that already an egg? No, that, that was not an egg. It was, let's see, um, female. So, female Dilophosaurus. Ah, goodness. What to call her? What to call her? I have yet to make, like, a, a good list of stuff. <laughs> so, um, hmm. I think we already used Sweet D on one of the dodos. I don't know why I gravitate towards that name for some reason. I just think it's it's onomatopoeia, you know, the letter D, what, whatever. Um, how about uh, um, wow, <laughs> well, I I don't know. I'll, I'll come back to names later, I guess. Um. Let's try to get these guys kind of closer to here. Come on. Good. Ooh, a pteranodon. Let's uh, let's set you guys to pass or that's no. I, I want you to just not follow me. Uh, enable wandering to mate. Tame. Okay, I don't think they're following me. Now let, let's let's take out this guy. They're, they're a decent source of hide. I'm not going to tame them just yet, but... Ah, oh, shoot. He got stuck. Huzzah. <laughs> Come on. Go to sleep. They're usually pretty delicate. Well... Okay. Oh, well. Um, I'm encumbered. Let's deal with that. 
I, I think if we eat some berries, I'd also like to let's uh let's put some clothes on. <laughs> oh my goodness, just just running around, you know, like in um naked as a newborn babe. Let's see, can I repair? I can. Nice boots. What's weighing us down? I guess all the rock we're carrying? Maybe. It's weird. He's just moving kind of slower. Oh well. Access our inventory. It's probably already, already full. Awesome. <laughs> Any eggs yet? Not yet. I need to get a whole bunch of females so I can get the eggs. Now, what I'll probably end up doing is over time, like, it's kind of brutal, but basically kill off dinosaurs after I've gotten unlock like the next level of egg tr like production. Um, and the reason for that is you have like a limit on the number of dinosaurs that you can tame at any given moment. And let's see, inventory again. I think it's filled, but we can get rid of some of the flint maybe and some of the, the chitin. Okay, okay, looking good, looking good. So what next, what next? Well, we got two dinosaurs tamed. Let's let's go back to that era, because they had a whole bunch of dialogue. Do I have any meats? Only 13. Let's, let's get a little bit of meat, and ooh, the weather's coming in, isn't it? Might... It looks like it could get kind of bad. Um, all right, let me see your inventory. We'll keep the, a little bit of me on you so you don't starve. And how about you? Huh? I need those the narco berries is what I want. Okay. All right, well, I think we're okay. Let's, let's continue on. <laughs> Can I make one of these? Oh, cool, it fills up because it's raining. Lovely. Uh, those, those water skins are actually quite good. You use some kibble, too, which I didn't realize. But, yeah, I've been, I've been doing some research, looking at kibble recipes, and getting a little excited. We're, we're, once you hit level 15, that's when a lot of stuff starts to come together. So, what's actually what I'm thinking about? Let's repair the wooden club, since it's, like, not in a good way. What, what do I need to repair this fiber? It's always... Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I promise I'll get better at like the inventory management and all that. So let's get some fiber. And then maybe go after... I'd love to go after some more of those um, dilos. Dilophosaurus. Just, and the funny thing is Dilophosaurus, like, they basically just stole it straight from Jurassic Park, this version of it. In reality, they were fairly large-sized theropod dinosaurs, so um, kind of precursors to uh, Allosaur Allosaurus and eventually, like, you know, Tyrannosaurus and all that. So, yeah, they're about 20, 25 feet long, and, and they obviously the spitting and the frill and stuff, like, that's all just... Oh, let's, let's repair this before we go over there, because it stinks when they break and you need them. So. Yeah, and a lot of this early wood stuff, it just breaks so fast, you know, it's it's a pain, but anyway, let's have our handy spear out. Oh, the, this, I also just loaded up the re most recent patch, and they have beavers, uh, castoroides, or whatever, in the game, and uh, yeah, they're, they're based on, there's actually, ooh, these, I don't really like these. They're, they're actually useful because, like, you can tame a big swarm of them, but they're so hard to tame, like, and they're dangerous. Like, they, they're the piranhas of the air, <laughs> the dimorphodon, so let's, let's avoid them. And just kind of, this river is relatively safe, but, but yeah, so there used to be in North America, one of my favorite megafauna was Castoroides, and it's basically... Uh, ooh, two together. I don't, I don't like the odds. I don't like the odds. I'm going to actually kind of check over by the, the coastline because the lower level dinosaurs hang out there. So I think 
we'll be better off. Well, let's have the spear while we go through this part of the jungle. It's just, yeah, I don't want another compy attack to, like, take us down. I'm so sick of those little jerks. They're just, oh, hey, they're the worst. Whoever thought that, hey, wouldn't it be funny if we had, like, a swarm, a dinosaur that can swarm you and give it high damage? Yeah, they'd fire that person. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I do not care for those. Oh, that's that's our, our, we already tamed them. I'll have to, like, I really do need to get, like, better on the, wait. Is this one that we tamed, like, way back in the day and... It's weird. Um, how do I make him fall again? T? Are you stuck? Oh, I tamed a, a male one later. Oh. Well, we only need one male. <laughs> oh, this guy mean. I'm thinking we only need one male, though. And, I mean, he is stuck, and now I'm encumbered. That's not good. Sorry, buddy. Yeah. I like how I just took out <laughs> your own creature was killed by you. Okay, well. I wonder if he has any goodies in his inventory. Yeah, let's take the meat. Don't need the rest, though. Yeah. Um, I, that's kind of vicious, but ultimately we're not keeping the Dilophosaurus, because... They're not they're not all that useful. I mean, if their spit did torpor damage or something, yes, but they don't. Well, let's just uh, split this and split this. Because I want to keep a... I said split. There. Uh, I want to keep a little bit of these materials in my inventory, but I need to add, add to my weight stat, too. Especially in single player. You need a little bit of weight carrying capacity. Otherwise, you're just going to, like, kind of be stuck having to do multiple runs back and forth between between stuff. So, that's my theory on that. Anyway, I, I feel fairly confident we got a spear now. No one can stop us. We, got, we have a mighty, mighty spear. So, were you uh, a dodo? Yeah. I probably tamed too many dodos as well, so I might look at their natural stats and kind of, like... Weed the herd. Ultimately, you only want tame dodos. They're so passive. Like, um, once you tame a flying dinosaur, you can swoop down, pick up a bunch of them, and then drop them into a cage. And so, that's what I'm going to ultimately do with them. So, yeah, if you're used to, like, having the dodos around, um, they're not going to be little tamed things at, for much longer. Now, I think I saw some Dilophosaurs around here. Yeah, like this little stretch of beach. Taming a parasaur might not be a bad idea either. They're part of the egg chain, but I don't know. They, they're not really useful and, and whatever. Like, ultimately, we're only going to keep the animals that have specific uses. Uh, stuff like... I just heard a noise. Uh, looks okay. None of the predator... Like, when the... the oops. Yeah, if we saw the parasaur, or, yeah, the parasaur running away, that's when we could panic, but I could probably hunt these turtles. Mm -hmm. Eh, I don't think I'm really hurting for meat in particular. Yeah, I'm looking okay. But ultimately, what, what I was saying is I want to just, I want to, what are you, a dodo, okay. Come on, we need more dilophosaurus. They're out there, they're out there, we'll find them. <laughs> the the hunt is on. Ultimately, though, uh, you have a limit on what you can tame, and it's it's seems like it's dictated by the size of the animal more than anything else, like the quote unquote model size. So on single player, like you can only expect to tame, say, uh, I don't know, like eighty dinosaurs total. And that seems like a lot, but I mean, you want there's a big variety of tames that we actually want. So ultimately, I don't think it's worth keeping. Oh, are you male or female? Can't quite tell. He's not mate boosted. Let's let's run up and smack him and finish him off if he's male. All right, female, perfect. Come on, go down and stay down. <laughs> 
Uh-oh. Coffees? I swear. Yeah, go away. Okay. I'm doing stuff. Okay. Here, have some raw meat and... Uh, actually, a little narco berry. Uh, still got the scary music playing, so I think the copy ran off and got help. Oh, you see that fin out there? It's either an ichthyosaur or a megalodon, and probably an ichthyosaur, but... I don't know. Ichthyosaurs would be interesting to... T oh, here comes the copy again. Alright. And boosted, which means... Uh, don't don't lag on me. Come on. Go down and stay down. I killed. How do I kill two at once? Weird. I don't see. Oh yeah, the other one. Ah, oh, snuck up behind me. They are such jerks. <laughs> I despise them. You know, they're like, hmm. Well, yeah. The answer to comp compies spears. So if you're playing long, if you're playing in single player. And you're having a tough time with the copies. Spears are the way to go. Uh, let's see. Only halfway through taming. Um, oh, level 7. That, that's why. Here. Ha have some more berries. Oh, I'll feed you two, actually. So, so yeah. Ultimately, I, I you know what? Honestly, I, I'm kind of glad I learned about the spear and the club. Because it seems like the club has been helping me a bit. So, especially in taming these guys. It keeps them knocked down and... Oh, we might even get like a plus one level on her. That'd be good. So, good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, I should I should eat. I am hungry. Meat. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's odd how some stuff lasts for longer than you think it would and other stuff doesn't. Okay, so the sun's going down. This might be the last tame that we can do. So, I really, I need to like save up a whole bunch of poo. <laughs> it sounds kind of gross, but, um, there's an animal I want to tame. Like, is that a travel bite? It is. Let's get him. <laughs> now, travel bites, they're super easy to kill, and they give you like chiden for days. Which is really nice. So, come on. Go down. Come on. There we go. Oh, we got Dozier. Very nice. But, basically, the whole deal with Trilobites is you get uh, another... Let's let's not name them yet. You get a lot of goodies off of these. Stuff like, yeah, silica, pearls, oil. They're basically living treasure chests. So, when you see one, go for it if, if you can reach them. Okay, cool. We got another Dilo. Uh, we, we probably want like at least one more female, but I'm feeling like we need we need to get back. It's starting to get dark, and you know being out with copies in the area at night. Yeesh. I really I can't stand those things. I can't stand them. They're the worst. Uh, it because a lot of the other crit critters that can swarm you, they they don't really. Uh, okay, sorry. Just looking around again. I, where, where's the Dilo? Okay. A lot of the other critters that can swarm you, like the bugs, they die really quickly. And it seems like the compies don't. Like, they, they live long enough to run off and get help. So, they're, I, I, yeah. <laughs> and it's probably just because they've surprised me and, and taken me out, like, three or four times, which... You know, now that I'm aware of the danger and I have a spear, I'm I'm not as worried about them. But I don't know. I'm I'm shell shocked in a way. They they've been doing quite a number of damage on me. So, now oh, let's get our torch. It's starting to get get a little bit dark out there. I th I think I I know the area we're in. So yeah, we should be okay. There's that uh that Bronto. I think it's a Bronto. I don't think they ever even put Diplodocus into the game. I might be wrong though, because uh, they had like it's it's they have all these like kind of concept art pieces they put out, but it's like they they stopped updating it, and I don't know if they're ever going to actually include the dinosaurs that they're talking about or not. Um, and and the funny thing is, there's still some dinosaurs that I'm shocked they haven't like 
even mention in passing as, oh yeah, we're definitely, oh. Did he get stuck? Yeah, or she, she. Oh man. That's one thing, I, I wish the dinosaurs would snap to you after a period of time, like teleport to you. Because now I get to play this game of like, having to retrace my steps, figure out which rock, which random rock my dinosaur got stuck on. Oh, yeah, yeah. And, of course, it's dark. <laughs> there could be all kinds of... Huh. I might need to stop and make, like, a little shelter. It, it's spamming that warning. Let's, let's... Because if I'm about to freeze to death because that warning is popping up. Alright, let's get some flint. 